today, we will see some misconceptions related to reflection and symmetry. Misconception 1. Find the reflection of the given figure in the mirror line. Some students fail to understand the concept of reflection. In order to write the reflection of the left side, they copy it as it is and select option 1, which is wrong. Some students write the reflection in an inverted position that is upside down. This gives them the answer as option 2, which is also incorrect. Some students are well aware that the right part of the object appears to be left and the left part of the object appears to be right in the image, but they use this understanding incorrectly and they first write C, then B and then A. This gives them option 3, which is also incorrect. The correct understanding is that the distance from the mirror line of any point located in front of the mirror line is equal to the distance from the mirror line of its reflection. Let's talk about C. The farther this point is from the mirror line, the farther we will make its reflection. Similarly, let us take one more point. Its distance from the mirror line will also be equal to the distance from the mirror line of its reflection. Similarly, we can make the reflection of the figure located on the right in this manner. That is, option 4 is the correct answer. Misconception 2. Find the reflection of the given image in the mirror line. Some students don't pay attention to the mirror line while finding the reflection. They ignore the mirror line and believe that the reflection of the image is given correctly in option 2. But option 2 is incorrect. Note that the tilted mirror line affects the tilted reflection. But the method of obtaining reflection is the same. That is, we will find the distance of the arrow from the mirror line of the lower part and mark its reflection at that distance. Then, we will find the distance from the mirror line of the upper part and mark its reflection at the same distance. Now, we connect the two points. This will give us an accurate reflection of the figure. So here, the correct answer is option 1. Therefore, when you find the reflection, always keep in mind the mirror line. So today, we saw some misconceptions related to reflection and symmetry.